As one of the biggest cities in the UAE, Dubai has got a lot going on, and most things come at an extravagant price. But believe it or not, there are plenty of free things to do in Dubai that barely need you to dig into your pocket at all. In this video, we're going to show you places where you can dodge the charges and do Dubai for free. Are you ready to go gallery hopping for free? What was once an industrial warehouse district has now become Dubai's most sought after creative hub. Home to contemporary art galleries, non-profit organizations and homegrown businesses, Al Circle Avenue is a growing art lover's paradise. The place displays artworks by artists from around the world in a warehouse spaces that will let you bond over art and culture. One of the really nice things about Al Circle Avenue is that it is free and very easy to access. From unique exhibits to cultural events, the avenue hosts over 40 creative concepts and has over 20 world-class art galleries. Even if you are not an art fan, this place is worth a visit. Apart from art galleries, there are auto showrooms that houses over 100 vintage cars and an art house cinema with a retro theatre screening. Making it a perfect place for an art fix, this place will leave you asking, when will you return? The next thing on our list is a record-breaking show that effortlessly blends science, technology and art together. Could you imagine that? The Imagine Show at the Bi Festival City Mall offers an immersive sensory experience like no other. The show features 30 dancing water fountains, interactive imagery, fireworks and dramatic sound effects. The show has earned two Guinness World Records for the largest water screen projection and the largest permanent projection mapping. If you visit the Dubai Festival City Mall, be sure to stop by the Festival Bay Arena and watch the space completely transform into something spectacular every night. Imagine features three exciting storylines and a total of six shows are played every evening. This visually stunning show is bound to impress people of all ages. And again, this site is absolutely free of charge. This one's for the nature lovers and campers. Al Kudra Lake, one of Dubai's most popular camping spots, is located in the middle of the desert. It is home to a hundred species of birds, plenty of wildlife and desert plants. Al Kudra is not just for campers, but for anyone looking to escape the hustle and bustle of the city life. Go bird watching, admire the wildlife, walk through the waterways, or simply just enjoy the desert vibe. Another great addition to this man-made architecture are the Love Lakes, which is just a 10 minutes drive from Al Kudra Lakes. Two huge interconnected heart-shaped lakes surrounded by sand, and the trees are arranged in such a way that they spell out the word love. There is no entry fee to the lakes as of now. It is absolutely free of charge for anyone visiting. So there is no reason why not to visit, especially in the cooler months. This next attraction is completely different from the glamour side of Dubai. Russell Core Wildlife Sanctuary is a precious protected bird sanctuary that's home to over 20,000 water birds belonging to more than 67 species. Situated right at the mouth of the Dubai Creek, this tropical forest provides a safe home to birds that migrate to Dubai in winters. The sanctuary is closely monitored by Dubai Municipality and is protected by a fence. However, there are two strategically located bird heights that can be accessed and there are binoculars for closer views. The entry to the sanctuary is free and the best time to visit here is between October and March to spot some rare species of birds. Complementing the world's biggest mall and the world's tallest tower is the Bay Fountain. A visual treat to the eyes, the arc jet shoots up down 500 feet, synchronized with illuminating lights and music. You can watch the spectacular performance from inside the Dubai Mall itself, but the best spot is the waterfront promenade outside the mall and from the restaurants and cafes in the vicinity. Are tickets required to watch the show? Nope, it's completely free of charge. All you have to do is get there early to get the best view. 
Even though Dubai has many water fountains, there is none like the Dubai fountain. It is one of the most loved watermarks in the world, and art in itself and the experience is magical. We are at one of Dubai's most popular and free beaches, Kite Beach. As the name suggests, this beach is a hub for kite surfers. Besides kite surfing and the usual beach stuff, there are plenty of sports like beach tennis, skating, volleyball, soccer and outdoor gyms that can be enjoyed without shelling a single penny. The beach also has a 14km cushion running track, so you can hit the trail and enjoy a stunning view of the Burj Al Arab as you run along the beach. We all know that fitness classes in Dubai can be pricey, so why not get active on the beach and get your sweat on free of charge? The last one is one of the best free things to do in Dubai. Riverland Dubai is an entryway to Dubai Parks and Resorts, which is designed like a theme park itself, except you can access it for free and stay for as long as you like during the operating hours. Riverland is divided into four buzzing zones, each with a unique theme. India Gate, the French Village, Peninsula and the Boardwalk. There's a six meter deep man-made river that connects all these zones and hence the name Riverland. All these features make Riverland a perfect hangout option for families and friends. The ice on the cake, it doesn't require any ticket.